Okay, here's the, here's the thing. Uh, Glenn Peloso here. Um, so Glenn, a little behind the scenes here. Yeah. He always has a watch that he always times like the segments because he doesn't trust right. what, my, what I say. Right. So you don't have your watch today. And today I don't have the watch, so now I'm completely <laughs> reliant on Tim, which <laughs> seems like a bad choice. <laughs> oh, uh, we got five minutes to talk about springing spring into your home, Glenn. Wonderful. Go ahead. Excellent. <laughs> so, I mean, essentially it's the time of year where you want to just lighten things up. You want to sort of mm. clean up the house, get rid of some of those heavy knitted, you know, furry. <laughs> so, so you can see like the cushions here, they're, they're starting to be more of a just a, a Simple cotton, more sort of a twill, easy, gentle, more like the the summertime. Are but these covers or these actual new pillows? The, well, these are actually new pillows, but you can just buy covers. Then you use the fill from your old pillows, put the new cover on, and I then you don't have the storage to put all these pillows. Well, like this the, if without the, the the without the fill is just a you know yeah, a little teeny. I mean. You can fold it up, wash it, put it back on, yeah. and so that's a smart thing to be able to do. And then you can continue to reuse the pillows, uh, you know, without having to change, change them. Change them back forth. Have a look at changing up some of the bedding. So as opposed to having sort of heavy blankets on. This is now just a simple cotton. Mm -hmm. One of the things that's sort of interesting, and I'll talk about it, you know, the next time I'm here, because I'll be at the High Point Market coming up, and I'll be able to tell you about some of the trends that we're seeing coming High forward. High Point Market? Yes. What so is it? High Point is, uh, is in North Carolina. It's a, it's a furniture and uh, design market, really, okay. where sort of all of the furniture manufacturers come from around the world. Everybody goes there to buy and to see what's new. Work with trends and things like that? All that kind of thing. But yeah. if you, a lot of the retail stores are go going there to be able to find out what's new and bring that back to their store. So it's sort of an advanced peek at what you're going to see coming up. So I'll, I'll, I'll tell you about that the next time here. Um, but change up that sort of, so the, one of the things that we're seeing is these really sort of complicated patterns now. So a little bit more old school as you can see in the pillow, mm. really complicated chintzy kind of detailed patterns. We're seeing that all over again. Um, but find something that's a little bit more cotton-like to, to put onto the bed so that you don't have something as heavy as you used to have. Are these faux flowers? No, they're absolutely real, Tim. Mm. A sweet smell of plastic. Uh, right? Oh Don't yes, you love and the that? plastic in the morning. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's, it's the way to to really brighten up the day. But like full flowers are great. Like they do look real. They look wonderful. And if you if you're like if you have a cottage or even if you you know not gonna your your bathroom is in the middle of the house. I have one downstairs. Nothing. Yes. I, I, I was trying. Like want real flowers this, and nothing survived there. So yeah. you have something there that always sort of looks nice. And you're gonna change those up. Something a little bit lighter. Something a little bit more perhaps in sort of a you know a cream or a white vase as opposed to doing something that was a little heavier that rose kind of those deep deep colors you want to let mm. those go a little bit and bring something lighter change up even just the hand towels in the bathroom can change the way that that room feels you go from you know a gray or a heavier you know color that's patterned to something that's light and bright we're seeing these sort of really beautiful greens again I went up a lot with greens when I did this poll mm -hmm. um, and that's a nice thing to do art so if you have... Did you do this, Glenn? I did, just oh, in, this goodness. morning while wow. I was waiting for you to get through the, the is, first part man. of the show. I just quickly oh, penned a little something. I like to keep You're busy. You're a good friend of mine. I had no idea you had this kind of talent. Right? So uh, we learn the new things about each other all the time. Every day. But being able to change up the art, get something a little bit more bright, a little bit more fun. You know, you can get rid of some of those heavier, more sort of serious photos that you might have in this wintertime mm -hmm. and go with something that has some brightness and some lightness. It just creates a really nice... Little, and, it's, and it's a relatively easy thing to change. And a relatively easy thing to store. They're just going to take up a certain amount of My space. My paintings always go into the laundry room because that's where they would look best. <laughs> yes, well... The laundry room. Nope, I'm the only one that goes into the laundry it's room. It's only because you don't have a man room and you don't have an, your own office that you could take that Put to. Put them in the laundry room, Put sweetie. They would look great down there. Okay, we got a minute and a half left. doesn't mean that they look great. Um, uh, so, you know, getting some... Going with some of the flowers that we're seeing at this time yeah. of year, so the hyacinth, and that is a nice thing to be able to do. Uh, in the kitchen, you know, change up the, the the hand towels so that the the things that you're the, you know the reds and the heavy colors that you had in the kitchen go with something light and bright you know change up your throws you always like to wear the throws yeah so yeah I do yeah, especially in the spring thank yeah. you yes yeah, thank uh, you and you can see that this is opposed to being something that is you know a, a heavy wool or something that's super knitted this is kind mm -hmm. of a again a light cotton that and this is the kind of thing that you're going to throw over your shoulders in the middle of the summer in the or middle of the it, spring or, or, or even like those colder those colder nights if you are sitting outside. You can, you, can, you can wear it, you can wear it okay. like a toga. They're yelling in my oh, ears, they, they say 30 seconds. Okay, 30 seconds, we use this yeah. up. Uh, the other thing that I think is sort of fun is just, you know, something like take some of the house plants you have around the house and, and mm. put them into sort of a, a, a different pot. It really changes the whole look of the way that the flower is just by changing the way that the, the, the pot is. Mm. Again, plastic, but, mm -hmm. you know, I can't bring everything real to mm -hmm. you. No, I know. Uh, yeah. And then once you sort of get through the house, changing all of these kinds of things up, it's going to feel way Five, brighter and lighter. Four, and it's going to be a fantastic three, thing. Two. So good. One. See you tomorrow. It was too long, those last. <laughs>